Um, to cut the story short, what happened was last year I started doing spoken word poetry and one of the poems that I performed in at an event was recorded. And what happened was one of the organisers from CAB, I think it was Lindis, who saw the poem, liked it and then basically invited me to perform at this event. Which is how I got to know about CAB, the campaign for the accountability of American bases. And um, yeah, here I am. So that's how this poem is my war cry, my war cry against the shadow, a deep and dark shadow that replaces dreams with nightmares and introduces a, wo a mother to sleepless nights because the sun's not there. I think drone use is disgusting, it's despicable. I think what it does is it tries to legitimise the act of killing but it takes away the killer from the killing fields. Uh, so by remotely doing it, the killer, I mean the person who presses the button, the drone operator, is really emotionally detached from the scene of the crime. And therefore they can basically, you know, operate drones from Men With Hill, press a button and then come out for a fag break. While over millions of miles away in Pakistan, the drone that has been dropped has killed innocent people, babies, and lives have been ruined. A deep and dark shadow that takes lives through guns and knives, not differentiating because to the Grim Reaper, a life is just a life. A weapon is a weapon, it can hurt. So drones are, are, are something that should be made illegal. They, they detach the drone operator from the scene of where the drone act, strike actually takes place. And that is wrong because if, say, like if something happens where a drone gets a drop, which is happening now anyway, and innocent people are dying, the, the person who done it is not there, the scene of the crime. From knives to drone strikes, from the US to Palestine, this is my war cry. For a world done away with the arms trade and warfare, this is my war cry against those paid to paint pictures of foreign enemies that aren't there. You know what, we need to join organisations like CAB to shut down these military bases. But I'm pretty sure it's not just these military bases. There are other centres in Europe and the UK where drone operations are taking place. We don't know them, but as a democratic state, we need to know them. And it should be in our rights to basically disagree with the use of drones. Jeopardising human rights, namely being the basic right to life, is one of the reasons why our mothers cry and why millions have breathed their last breath, leading me to write this war cry, where we value life instead of death. Thank you. That's the first one. Okay. Um...